Hey everyone, this is Panorama Dan. Carmen and I are out traveling today again. <clears throat> We're on the western part of our 40th anniversary adventure. We might have some uh, helmet hair because we're out on a bike ride and we've made it to um, Vancouver and uh, up just across the border in, into Canada and uh, there was a bike ride that um, Carmen had found and we just uh, were really excited about taking it so we've been we're about three quarters of the way through it but I thought this is a good vantage point to kind of show you a little bit of Vancouver and uh, I want to just say Vancouver has got it going on now it is a super bike friendly and just friendly for all activities there's uh, along these this corridor I'm going to do a little panorama get you turned around and see a little bit what's behind me but this leads out to the bay there's Rogers Arena there <clears throat> and this little inlet worked its way all the way out into a really big bay borders um, to this side to the, this side Stanley Park which is an enormous um, park here in the city but <clears throat> on both sides of this long I'll call it a canal but it's really just a, a finger off of the bay uh, it's eight miles long there's bike trails there is walking trails and they're separated there is playgrounds and just small little parks to um, sit and enjoy the view. Of course there's vendors and there's beaches and there's a little bit of everything. <clears throat> but if you're anywhere near Vancouver and I encourage you to come. The weather's a beautiful day. It's going to be 85 so it's going to be a little warm. It's supposed to get down into the 40s tonight here but we'll be back in Birch Bay, Washington. Um, in two or three hours but uh, yeah so I've finished my panorama up obviously you can't get a full flavor of what's going on here just by this one panorama but it's a it's a metropolitan area that really has set aside a lot of um, park areas along premium real estate I'm gonna swim back around while I finish up uh, this area where these bike parks and paths are in most cities across the U.S. Uh, it's prime real estate. It'd be sold off to a developer. Condos or some kind of business would be there to enjoy the view. But the public would never get to enjoy this. <clears throat> but Vancouver, whoever was in charge of setting this, the city up, really did a wonderful thing by leaving this area uh, accessible to the general public to enjoy, to um, get exercise, and, and just to feel the beauty of being outside when you're in a metropolitan city. All right, well, um, thanks for uh, clicking on this video and watching it, and thanks for, uh, if you've been along for the ride as we've gone across the U.S., we still got more to go. We're going to be going to Yellowstone in a week or so, and and some other places so there'll be some more videos coming about our travels might throw in some other small videos product reviews and things along the way so be sure to uh, like this video and subscribe if you've stumbled onto us so that you get notifications when we put out uh, new content well this is Daniel Panorama Dan and uh, it's saying it's a great big beautiful world out there now go out there and enjoy it <laughs>